Uterine cancer is the most common gynecologic cancer, accounting for 6% of cancers in women in this country alone. Hysterectomy is the typical treatment, but traditional hysterectomy is not without its drawbacks. The traditional approach has been to perform a large abdominal incision, remove the organs uh, and the areas that the cancer is either spread to or a suspicion that it's spread to. Obviously, for a surgeon, the larger the incision, the greater the vision. Unfortunately, that method leaves the patient with a bigger scar and longer recovery time. With Da Vinci Robotic Assisted Surgery, you get the best of both worlds. It's a laparoscopic procedure, uh, meaning that we make small incisions in the patient's abdomen instead of the traditional longer incisions. And through the, the center portion, we send down the instruments into the abdomen to operate. As well, there's usually a central one that we have a camera which is obviously a small camera that also goes into the abdomen. I feel as a surgeon, this provides me an advantage from a visual standpoint. I can see the anatomy better, the structures better, and everything that I want to remove and safely avoid. When you first look into the console and, and you see the visualization, you almost feel as if you're inside the patient. In addition to improved visualization, Da Vinci is pretty handy when it comes to operating surgical instruments. That's because every movement is initiated by the surgeon. Da Vinci is literally at the doctor's fingertips. With a Da Vinci, I'm moving the camera and all the instruments myself. There's no guesswork. Because of the smaller incision, there's less risk of infection. And instead of four to six weeks of recuperation, the patient's recovery time is reduced to about two weeks. I had a patient that we operated on uh, and she went home the very following day. She woke up the next morning and said, I feel great. With the use of the robotic assistant in gynecological procedures, the list of surgical applications for da Vinci is growing and now includes urology, cardiology, and even pediatric surgery, a major step for Mid-South Medicine. What it also adds into the medical community uh, in the Memphis area, um, that we are in line with other major medical centers across the country who are promoting advanced laparoscopic procedures or robotic procedures. The sky's the limit, per se, in terms of what we can do. And Da Vinci will be there to lend your surgeon a hand, or four. For Smart Medicine, I'm Rod Starnes.